Welcome back guys to my channel and here I am again your sister Tess so what I'm going to do is this tablecloth centerpiece tablecloth it is a something it is a piece so you can use it for your table okay so be with me guys so guys this is what I am going to do it is a tablecloth as you see it is combined I created it to be a tablecloth so I will show you how to do the every piece of it because this is a, this is one piece one piece and one piece and I just connected it to be long and square Anyway, it's not a square. You can make it triangle or whatever you want. But this is, as as you see, it is created. I did it. So to make this tablecloth, I made many pieces of this flower. This mini flower. It is a small flower design, and then I connect it together, all together to create this tablecloth so what i'm going to show you today is to to go to to do this flower so how to do this flower and that is our tutorial for today okay so uh, look guys it is very very cute and simple so if you made your mind how long and how big you want you will just keep creating like this and then connect it together okay guys so stay with me and we will start now guys i will use this crochet hook metal the small one it is number three and with the thread the fine one the white one we use for for centerpiece okay so to start with i will make a chain of i will make a chain of 12 guys so it is very easy we will do 12, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, and 12. After the 12 chain, we will create a circle. Of course, we will join it from the first chain. To create a circle okay so it is a circle and then after the circle we will make a half crochet we will make a half crochet all around the circle so one chain equivalent for one half crochet and then half crochet two and three we will do 24 guys 24 single crochet all around the circle okay so keep making single crochet half crochet sorry half crochet or all all around the circle okay so anyway guys if you are new to my channel don't forget to like share and subscribe that's the button bell so every time i have new video uploaded you will be notified okay so as i said continue until you will have a 24 half crochet inside the circle okay so i have here 24 24 half crochet in all around the circle and then i will join it from the first chain we did it so join it and 
and then for the next round we will do this top this was the the, the first first thing we did the circle and then now we will go to to this portion okay so we will do a chain of five three four and five this is one double crochet and two chain space okay and then we we'll take a loop and make a double crochet beside beside the chain this was the chain and this is the next the next to it you will make double crochet double crochet okay just beside its other and then make a space of three three chain and then leave the two chain from here and go to the third chain so one two and then this is the third one so here we will do double crochet double crochet and from here the chain space here it's only two so two chain space and then one double crochet just the chain next to it so if you notice from here two double crochet besides its other and there is two chain space and then here down you will leave two chain space and from up you will have three chain space so as we we did it from from here we just repeat it here we just repeat it here so again here we will repeat this one so again this is three chain space one two three chain space and then we will leave the two chain from down and we will go to the third one we will leave the one two and we will give we will be here and the third chain again double crochet and then two chain space and then to the chain beside it again double crochet so we will just repeat it the same thing two double crochet beside its other but there is two chain space and then from here we will leave two chain space and here we will have three chain space so we will continue and keep doing the same thing again here we have three chain three chain space and from here we will leave two so from the third one one two three from the third chain and double crochet two chain space and then here beside it double crochet okay do it until the end of the row okay guys so your work will look like that i am here at the last space now guys so we should have uh, by the way we should have six pairs okay so this is one the first pair one two three four five and this is this the six number six the last one we should have six one two three four five and six after this three chain space we will connect it from the first double crochet so connect it and then just take the yarn from inside take the yarn and make a slip knot to take the yarn from inside okay and then for this for the next round we will do here half crochet one chain equivalent for half crochet in this space in between these two double crochet which we have two chain space we will do two half crochet okay two half crochet in this three chain space we will do we'll take the yarn from here and then like that half crochet and then a chain of two and then half crochet at the same space of course and then three chain space and then half crochet and then two chain and then half crochet this is all together in this space 
so again I will repeat I will repeat guys from the two chain between these two double crochet we will do two half crochet one and two here in the three chain space we will do one one half crochet with two chain space and then half crochet and then three chain space half crochet and then two chain space then half crochet so it is very easy in this three chain space we will have here half crochet with two chain space and then at the center three chain space and at the end it is two chain space so it is very easy this is two chain space with half crochet two chain space with half crochet and at the center we have three chain space with half crochet so we will just repeat it guys until the end of the row so you can see there is like this like a pointed a bit pointed okay so again for the last time i will show you again we will take the yarn from the space and make a half crochet of course this is only two because this is the the space between the two double crochet and then again we will take the yarn from the three chain space make half crochet with two chain space and then three chain space half crochet and then for the last one it is two chain space and half crochet so just repeat it guys until the end of the row it will look the same it will be like that guys now i'm done i'm done guys and as you see it is very nice cute so here now we will join it from the first half crochet we will join it and it is done because this is the last last round we will easily join it and you can cut the yarn but for me i will not cut it guys because i will show you how to join it so it is it is well done this is done so simple but very nice okay look at this pointed and the raw end and the edge okay so to join and to create a, a tablecloth here guys you will do this first from line here because there is something a bit different going up you have to join from the two from the two corner you will have to join from the two corner and from the side it will be one only so here one from here one and here two so this one you should create first until you reach the length you want this is two four six and if you want a bit bigger or more you can just add it but to join it before i will cut this from the two from the two edges here you should join so before we will finish and cut the yarn we need to join it so i will show you how so from going up what we need to to what we need to join is the two space this one that we need two chain two spaces the big one and the center will be this two double crochet so we need this one and this one from here we started okay so here this is the the two the two half crochet And then this is the second to the last from the three chain space 
this is the second this is the last and this is the second to the last forget this two chain space here because what will happen we will come to this space we will do this one this half crochet with two chain space and then half crochet okay and here the three chain space we will take the third chain sorry we will take the second chain we did one chain okay and then here from the other piece from the other piece we will use the same place this is the three chain space and this is the three chain space so from the edge here and the edge here so we will take the yarn from here from where there is three chain space and then we will continue taking the yarn from there now we have two chain from the three chain space so another one and then half crochet And then we will continue from this two chain space and then half crochet. Okay, and then here we do the same. It will be single crochet, half crochet, sorry, half crochet in two. And then here at the center again, this is the last piece, last space having this three chain space. So we will have half crochet and then two chain space and then half crochet and then again one chain and for the second chain we will use it to connect in this one in this other piece together so this is the center and then from there we will take the yarn we will take the yarn for the second chain space and this is the third chain space and again half crochet and then two chain space and then half crochet and then we will join it from the first chain we did it from the from the this same row and then finish and cut the yarn so it is here it is now connected so this is two together connected now okay so you do the same guys when you finish or completed the length you want then you want to do the side from the side it will only need one one connection okay so i hope guys you understand what i mean from going up to and from the side one so this is the result okay so i hope you guys can follow so this is the end of our project and as i said it is very easy and very simple okay guys so again thanks for watching and god bless